Nat 20. Welcome back to A Deal with Demons. In our previous episode, our adventures were once again in the depths, but this time they found a prison camp that had thousands upon thousands of kind of slave labor people there who they assumed are from uh, Somersale and from Avranches. Uh They kind of s- snuck near there and saw that there was one Balazau guarding the entire, like, the tunnel to there. They charmed the Balazau and got him to uh, bring the Shardana captain and a mage there, as well as putting a bunch of explosives near the cabins for the Shardana. Uh, the captain and mage then came. The captain had a teleportation stone with him. They killed the captain and mage stole the teleportation stone, charmed another Balazau, and they, and uh, Lazarus is running towards where the Chardonnay cabins are to try to set up the explosives in the tunnel there. And there is another Balazau that has seen him. Or I think there are two Balazau that have seen, seen him nearby. One near the tunnel to the Chardana barracks and one that's just watching over the entire prison camp. And you guys have the other prisoners from the actual prison with you, including Borknorg the Science Orc and a Dragonborn who are both in alright condition and are able to help you guys out. And Borknorg had just set fire to the explosives that he, that are between that are in the tunnel between this prison camp and the demon town. So what would everyone like to do right now? We're out of initiative, right? Yep. Uh you do see a Balazau about a hundred feet away from you, Lazarus. Well I'm since... pretty sure Oh yeah, sorry. Since he's in range, I would just attack him with my bow, but what would Evan Ellis do? Well, I said I was racing after you, didn't I, uh, Zach? Because you were heading to blow up the other cave. Yeah. Yeah, so I said, like, I was, like, dashing to, like, after I picked up my knives. I was going to kill that kill that dude for you so you didn't have to worry about him. Okay. Uh, what is, is everyone else running that direction, too? Yeah, that's what I said last time, too. Okay. Tell Aelnil, are you guys running there too? Yeah, I'll go with. Okay. Yeah, I might as well. I mean, you know. Stand here by ourselves. Nothing else to do. Yeah, I'm just gonna... <laughs> yeah, I'll, I shall follow. Okay, you guys do also know that Borgnork and the Dragonborn are at the edge of the tunnel, just ready to protect the other prisoners in case an enemy comes their way. They got it handled. I'm, I'm quite confident. Yeah, I mean, they sealed off that cave, so I mean, like, I'm not really worried about them now. They'll be fine. Okay. Uh, so, Lazarus, you can fire your arrow, uh, and everyone else is still probably about 60 feet behind him. Oh, that's cool. Uh, since I have multi-attack, I'm shooting two arrows. My first one okay. was a nat 1, and my second one is going to be a 16. Yeah, that's 16 hits. Wait, are you shooting the Bowser? Yeah. Oh, okay, cool, cool, cool. I mean, might as well do some damage as I'm getting close. Oh, that's fair. Uh, That would be 7 damage. 7 damage? Yeah. Okay. Fuck his ass up! Now I would stay where I am, because I know that they can sprint pretty far. Yeah. Yeah, so he's just gonna run up the next... Er, he's gonna dash and run up 80 feet, so he's now within 20 feet of you. Cool. And everyone else is uh, starting to come closer to you. Um, how far back are we now? You'd be, uh, if you guys were dashing, you'd probably be between 20 and 40 feet behind him. Oh, okay. Um, 
I guess we catch up the rest of the way? Yeah, you'll catch up the rest of the way on the next turn. So, uh, can everyone actually roll initiative right now? Yeah. That makes sense. If I have to. Bad news bears. What if I give you $5, Gage? Take that as a no. All right. <laughs> then he'll roll for you. Got a, uh, uh, I got a 14 for initiative. I got a natural hey, one. Too. <laughs> Woohoo! Look at oh, us man. go. Fantastic start. It does become it, a three. There are actual good things that can come from going last, okay? Yeah, it's not uh, the worst time to get a one. That's for Ryan sure. Nazareth? Twelve. I got a five. How long does a potion of strength last? Isn't it like an hour? I don't know. I think it's an hour. Yeah. Okay. You can check the DMG, it'll show you, so. Check the what? Sorry, the what? DMG, the Dungeon Master's Guide, it should oh, tell you. Yeah, I don't have the DMG next to me. Oh, uh, I can look it up. Sure. Uh, so, Lazarus. So this Balazao is now within 20 feet of you, and... Uh, actually, yeah, Lazarus is going first. But because you're within 20 feet... The Balazao has a rotting presence, so I'll need to do a constitution saving throw. I definitely forgot about this the last time. Uh, what do I have to beat? A 13. I definitely do not. Okay. Uh, so you will take... Uh, you'll just take four necrotic damage. Okay. And it is your turn. Uh... Since the rest of my team is like here, I am going to move 20 feet up, pull out my long swords, uh, and multi attack. Okay. That is going to be a 12. And that's well, not hit. skewed. Uh, I miss both. Yeah, I guess I'll just stay here. Okay. Uh, next is Blaze. You are about 20 feet behind where Lazarus was, so now you would be... Uh, 10 feet behind... La or wait, so... He ran up 20 feet, so... He'd be 40 feet away. Yeah, you'd be 40 feet away from the battle. 40 feet away. Okay, I have a movement speed of 40. So I'm just going to run right up to this Bao Zhao guy. And I'm going to hit him. I still have no fucking key. Uh, I'm going <laughs> to hit him twice with uh, both my daggers. Okay. Okay, so first one is the obsidian dagger. That is a 17 plus 7. Yeah, it hits. Okay, cool. So, and then the diamond dagger is an 8 plus 7, 15. Both hit? Fuck yeah. Okay, sick. Uh, so the first one deals plus 4 is 9. So 10 damage. And then the second one deals 12 damage. So, okay. 22. Total. Okay. Oh yeah. That's all my uh, movement speed, so I can't run away. So. Okay. So next will be. Ryan. All right. Um. How far away am I from him? You'd be fifty feet away from the battle. Sweet. Okay. Well, there's shit all I can do then, so I'm gonna dash as my action and get right up to him. Okay. That's so you. Are you like right in his face then? Yeah, I'll get right up to him. Okay. Okay, cool. Uh, next is the Balazo. And it's going to attack Lazarus. Of course. With its barbed tail, since you're the person there. 
Does a 16 hit? It does not. Okay. Okay, then that's his attack. <laughs> Got him! <laughs> so next will be uh, Tal. Um, I think Tal is going to try and save what little spells she's got left. And throw a dart. Okay. I think I got to throw two of them, right? Uh, uh, yeah, it's like a dagger. One is an action, one's a bonus action. Yeah, yeah. Uh, that's a one and a two. Nice. Okay, yeah, so <laughs> both definitely miss. They nope. just barely miss hitting Blaze, actually. Yikes. Yeah, but I'm nimble as fuck, baby. <laughs> and how far are we? Did you run up at all, Tal? Um, I think I'll stay back, like, 20 feet for this turn. Okay, 20 feet away from the Balazel? Yeah. Okay. Uh, next is Aelendel. Fuck him up. Kill him, you big dead thing. <laughs> Baller. Um, how, how far away is he? Uh, from you, from without me? running forwards again, you, he would be, uh... See, Blaze is 40 feet away, right? Yeah, yeah so you would probably so. be 50 feet away. Okay. Uh, I'm going to move my 30 feet forward. So I'm only 20 okay. feet away. And I'm going to shoot my longbow okay. at him. Well, not shoot the longbow, but shoot an arrow from yeah, my longbow. Thanks for the clarification. <laughs> I really close. thought I I thought you were gonna throw a bow at him. Oh no problem. <laughs> That'd be so <laughs> funny. Just like, chuck my Jerk. entire bow. Uh, oh, okay. Does uh? <laughs> oh no. We're all gonna die. Uh, <laughs> this is good. I swear. Uh, does an <laughs> eight hit him? A good number though. Oh god. The air goes whizzing it's Actually, past. if you turn it sideways, it's infinity. <laughs> wow. You think maybe right. throwing your bow at it might have been a better decision now. If you, tu- if you turn, funny, if you turn your very funny. Stone, it's infinity, um, infinity always hits. That's true. He's got a good point. Um, well, I do have my second attack, yeah. so your boy's gonna shoot again. Pop, pop. All right. Uh, does a sixteen hit? Ooh, it does. Hell yeah. All right, this boy is going down. Uh, <laughs> three damage. Nice. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It doesn't get better than that, baby. <laughs> oh yeah, dude. You're uh, as your fighter. I'm really taking the heat of the the fight oh, right boy. now, bro. I I forgive you. You're using Dex right now when you're a fighter. So yeah. Yeah. So as you fire your arrow at him, it just nicks off a small section of his horn. And that's basically all. It doesn't seem to damage him too much. But it still damages him. Yeah. Fuck Whoa. yes. <laughs> and we'll go back to the top of the order with Blaze. Or with La- La- yeah, Lazarus. Okay. Um. Since everyone else is, like, catching up, and I think the Shardana is going to be coming out of their cabin since they heard the fucking huge explosion... Yeah. I'm going to use my action to disengage and run 30 feet towards the tunnel. Okay, can you also roll a constitution saving throw, please? Should oh, should I have rolled that then? Oh, is that just proximity? Mm. Yeah, at the start mm. of your turn, if you're oh, within okay, 30 cool. feet. Uh, yeah, I don't beat it. Okay, so you'll take another 7 damage. 7 necrotic damage. Would you believe me if I told you I was immune to necrotic? I would not. Oh, really? I believe him. Like, that was a convincing argument right there. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so, what are you doing now? I would have just disengaged and ran 30 feet towards the, uh, the okay. tunnel. Okay. And you do see another Balazow at okay. the entrance of the tunnel. How far away uh, would he be? Uh, he would probably be about 80 feet okay. away from where you are now. 
Uh, that's all I can do on my turn, though. Okay, sounds good. Collapse uh, that tunnel! Next is Blaze. Fuck yeah, I'm gonna fuck him up. I'm gonna hit him with my daggers again. So the first one is... Oh, shitty. 12. Yeah, that does not hit. Uh, something told me it wouldn't hit. Uh, and then the diamond dagger is a... Ooh, that's much better. 18 plus 7 is 25. It hits. Cool, so that's 1d6. Got a 4 plus... Uh, eight, nine, ten, uh, 11 points of piercing damage. 11? Okay. Yeah. Um, I think that's all I can do, so I'm just gonna just gonna insult him. You're one ugly, oh, And also, since you're within 30 feet, please roll a constitution saving though. Fuck! Uh, uh, 10 plus nothing. Yeah, so you will take uh, 3 necrotic damage. Nothing. Okay, cool. And then yeah, I'll just I'll just be like, you're a bitch, and that's wow. it. Okay. Uh so next uh he doesn't seem to understand what you said, so he doesn't react to it at all. But he is angry that you keep on hitting him with, with some daggers. I uh next stop. is Ryan. Okay. Um First off, he like we barely damaged him at all, right? He's looking fine. Uh, you've done a fair amount of damage. Oh, okay. Um, He's taken, like, four dagger hits and a yeah. couple of sword wounds. And an arrow, I think. But he's not, like, near death. Uh, somewhat. Okay. Um, what is the layout? Like, there's, like, a, a pit next to us, right? Yeah, so this guy has moved to the right of the pit so that he's not anywhere close to the ledge anymore. Okay. But there is a pit that has... Uh, three different layers. Uh, one, the layer below you, as you look, seems to be mostly the prisoners just hauling up materials to this level. All, and then carrying it to the uh, southwest end of the area, where there are more people who are able to take up the buckets from that level up to the level you guys are on. Okay. Um, and how far are we from the pit? From the pit, you'd probably be about 15 feet away, 20 feet okay. away. Okay, okay. Uh, so then for my move, I'm going to try to grapple him and drag him closer to the pit. Okay. Uh, because you are within 30 feet, please roll a constitution saving throw. That's a 6 plus 4, 10. Yeah, uh, that is not enough, so you will take just 2 necrotic damage. Okay. Constitution is the one thing I'm good at. Uh, oh, so okay. yeah, you're just trying to grapple this guy. Yeah, and okay. yeah, I so I don't I don't know. Can I like grapple and drag on the same turn, or do I have to? Uh, you're what within twenty feet? You're no, 20 I'm like feet away I'm right you? in his face. Oh, right in his face. Yeah. Uh, I'd say you could grapple grapple him for an action, and you could take. And then, like, dragging him is half my movement speed or whatever, right? Yeah. Yeah, I'd say that, yeah. Okay, okay. All right. Uh, just a strength check, then? Yep. Oh, God. Don't fuck me. That is a 15. He got a 3, so you're hey. pretty easily able to grab okay. him. Okay. And then half my movement speed is 12 feet, so I will... I will it. also have you do a... Uh, yep. No, I'm going to have him do a dexterity save and throw as you drag him. Okay. And what did you roll for strength? Because he just rolled a 17. I I think I said Plus 15. Two. You said 15. Yeah. Okay, so you drag him about halfway to the pit. So like 10-ish feet away. And then he's able to kind of scramble out. Of your grip. Uh, I thought to break a grapple, he had to use his action on his turn. Okay, sure. Well, I mean, I just... Here, that's just what right I now. thought. I don't want to... Um, like, you, 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 it's your decision. I just, I, That's just what I thought he had to do. No, let's bully Gage so we can make it happen. <laughs> Dude, bullying is my fourth favorite hobby. Where the fuck is combat? Check him out of the Discord! <laughs> 
Escape Viva in a grapple. Revolution. A grappled creature can use its action to escape. To do so, it must succeed on a strength or a dex check contested by your strength. Cool. It has to use its action. Oh. Okay, cool. Yeah, so he is still grappled, and you <laughs> fucking reminds me of my old wrestling feet. days in high school. Oh, so far, moving a grapple creature. When I move, I can drag the grappled creature with me, but my speed is half. So yeah, I can drag him twelve feet. So that okay. I, move, I move twelve feet towards the, the left. So we're like three feet away from it now. Okay. So I just like watched him come up and like pick this dude up and then start walking away with him. <laughs> yeah. Yeet him off. All the right. Cliff. Good luck, buddy. And I'm gonna leave. <laughs> Uh, yeah, that's my turn, so. Okay, uh, he's gonna use his action to try to escape. He got an 18 plus 2, so 20. Wow, okay. Uh, no, that's a natural 2, so, you know. God damn! So yeah, he's free. Okay, and then he's gonna use the rest of his movement to get more near the center of this area again. Stays away from the cliff. Uh, do I get an attack of opportunity on him? I guess you would. Cool. Okay. Uh, I'm just gonna smack with a battle hammer then. That is a... Oh my god. Let's see. Plus four, plus three. Sixteen to hit. That hits. Okay. Uh-huh. 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 I don't use my battle hammer ever. 8 plus my strength is 12 damage. You kill him, so how do you do this? Oh, okay. Oh, well, as he's walking away, I'm just going to... Bonk him. Yeah, I'm just going to smack him in the back and crack open his spine. Or, yeah, crack his spine. Okay. Fucking epic Conan shit right yeah, there. That's a big bowl of yikes right there. Dude, I love <laughs> Conan, especially when he's got Justin Timberlake on. Dude, can you? Can I what? Nah. <laughs> okay. Just nah. I muted it, it's fine. Okay. Uh, so, yeah, you've killed the spells out, and... Uh, you guys are... Uh, what are you guys all doing now? You see Z- uh, Lazarus running towards the... Still running towards the... Uh, Tunnel. I'm just gonna shout encouragement as we run behind him. Like, go! Okay. Get him, Lazarus! Yeah! Blow up that tunnel! You got this! Okay, uh, since all of you would have started your next turn where the spell is out is, you will still have to roll a constitution saving throw. Even if he's dead? It's a rotting bre- present, so... Yeah, that's it's... fair. Oh, shit. Fuck. Okay, I rolled. Oh shit! I rolled a nineteen. Nineteen blaze is fine. Yes. Oh my god, that's my like third two that I've rolled today. I'm still Let's get it all out of your system. Plus I got a, four, a, so a six. sixteen gauge. I'm still twenty feet Healing back. Right? Is fine. Yes, Tony. Yeah, but you're within. Oh, uh, okay. Virtual high five, Tony, for us both succeeding. Does it count on the floor? Wow! Pardon? Does it count on the floor? Uh, no, just for your watch. Right. Hey, it was the same number. Um, Constitution, 14. <laughs> yeah. 14, you are barely okay. Woo! Go tell, first success of the day. Uh, and Lazarus was already further away, so... Yeah, I ran away. Uh, Ryan, you will take seven necrotic damage. Holy shit! Wow. So yeah. it's literally just me then? Oh my god. Okay, that's fine. I'm still fine. Mostly. You just you just gotta get good like us. Like I have a plus zero in Constitution. It does not get better than that. I have plus four con, so theoretically I should be fine. My con score is nineteen. It's all about how confidently you roll the die. Maybe I should try that. Just roll it real yeah, confident. Roll, get some nice wrist flick in there. I'm going to chuck it across my desk. Okay, brace yourself. <laughs> Natural one. 
Dude, you, that, that's not confidence. That's rage, okay? You, that need was, to be you need to be suave, smooth. When I roll my die, I channel my inner Brad Pitt. The most confident Watch. man alive. Watch. Boom. Just rolled a four, baby. Nice. Man, I should really follow your example. Hey, it's okay. better than a two and a one. So, Just we saying. all know that the best way to roll the die is by popping it in your mouth <laughs> and spinning it around and then letting it drop out. Uh, as you guys can probably hear from this. Okay, I'm going to do that. Cool. Oh, that's a natural one. That sounds like a really good thing to do right now. <laughs> I rolled another four. <laughs> yeah, this is, we're all cursed. This game is bad. Yeah, this is a bad episode for dice rolls. It didn't work, Tony. <laughs> yeah, can we cancel this episode, please? <laughs> Oh my God. Can we At just start over? Check. That was cool. Unfortunately, <laughs> Deal Demons was canceled in its second season on episode. No, we just start over. Something. Start from scratch. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, that's a wrap. All right. You wake up in the project. <laughs> and action. <laughs> so, what would everyone like to do next? I don't know. We haven't started the episode yet. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. <laughs> 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 I'm kidding. <laughs> Um, okay, so, okay, hold up, hold up, I have a legit thing. Um, so, we see that that dude is by the yeah. cave entrance of the Baozhou. Uh, is there any other monsters or Baozhous or demons uh, in that present Roll area? a perception check. I would love to, I just gotta put the die in my mouth one second. <laughs> just kidding. I rolled a 17 plus 5. So, uh, pretty good one. You don't see anyone else yeah. in this area besides yeah. the one Baozhou, but you do see... A bit further off to the north, a little bit to the northwest, a another Balazao just guarding the top side of the cave, top level of the uh, okay. cavern. When you say, yeah, when you say a little bit, how far he away? He would like? probably be like 150 feet away from you as the crow Does flies. It look like he's... Yeah. God damn it. Does it look like he sees us? Uh, he does not, no. <laughs> Alright, then I won't engage. I'll just follow oh, the ladders. Oh, Cal would like to pick up her darts. Okay, yeah, you're able to. Okay. Fantastic. And then she'll follow along with where everybody else is going. So... Yeah. Fucking blow that tunnel up, buddy! Blow yeah, it! Yeah, since the bow's yeah. out... 80 feet away, yep. and I see him. Do I also see the explosives? Uh, you the don't ground? see the explosives yet. They seem. You believe that they are. They might be a bit further into the t tunnel. Uh. Okay. I would just proceed closer until okay. I would see them. Try and get a shot on them. Okay. Uh. You have to be about 40 feet away from him and like to the left a bit just because the tunnel actually branches to the right. Well, I would have moved 30 feet closer and then since I still don't see them, I would just okay. shoot at Bowzow. Yeah, so just roll to it. Fuck these rolls, man. Roll out of your mouth. I got a... 12 and a uh, 17. Okay. Cool. Big damage. Uh, 4. 4 damage? Okay. Yeah. 4 damage? Yep. Wow. That's really the lowest amount of damage I can do. And uh, I think we'll just use the same initiative that we used last time. I just rolled again for the Balzo, but he got a 10. Uh... Plus two, so 12, actually. Uh, so, Blaze, is there anything you want to do right now? Oh, I'm first? Yeah. Well, Lazarus just Lazarus went, so. Oh. Um, Keep up. I mean, I can't really, like, I could throw my dagger, but then, like, if it blew up any kind of explosive, that would just ruin my dagger, and, like, I'm attached to these daggers. Oh my god, dude. We are literally about to die here. It'll be fine. I'm gonna run up. Uh, how the Bowser is eighty feet away from me, or is he? Yep. Then I'm just gonna dash all the way up to him. Okay. Yeah, because I have forty feet, so dash is eighty, so I can get right up there. Okay. And that's my action. So for my bonus action, as I'm running, can I whip a dagger at him? Sure. Fuck yeah, bro! I'm gonna throw the obsidian. So that is. <laughs> 
Uh, ten? Yeah, no, that does not hit. That's okay. It was a warning shot, bitch! And, uh... Again, he doesn't seem to understand what you're saying. I I translate. I keep forgetting that they don't... (laughs) Thank you, Tal. Thank you. See, now that's teamwork, motherfucker. Uh, Tal, do you speak abyssal? Oh, no. Um... Oh, abyssal, this guy I speaks speak abyssal. abyssal. Infernal abyssal. and ancient. So- oh, I can read. Oh ancient wait, no, I'm I'm just gonna red card and say they do speak infernal because Farron was able to speak with the one last time. Okay, then I okay. translate it into uh, infernal. Okay, that was a warning he, shot. Okay, bitch. The important. You see his eyes I just want to make like sure he's... glow. Well, open with anger a bit. I flip him off. Dude, I want him focused on me. Okay. <laughs> I want him focused on me, yeah. I make like a jerk off motion at him. <laughs> like, get fucked. <laughs> That's my turn. Okay, Ryan. That's a great turn. You're up next. Uh, yeah, uh, I move my 20 feet, 25 feet. Uh, you would probably away, be... A hundred or ninety feet away, I think. Oh god, ninety. Yeah. Ninety-five. Okay, I guess I'm just gonna dash then, because there's okay. nothing else I can do. My my stumpy little dwarven legs can't move that fast. Hey, okay, uh, so next is the Balzow, and <clears throat> it will attack you, Blaze. Bring it on, baby, Bitrotro. Got an 18 plus 4, so 22. Surprise, surprise, that hits. And he's using his barbed tail. Rolled a 1 for damage, so that is 3 in total. Nice. Nice. And oh, can you roll like a, a constitution saving throw me. for me, please? Oh, because he hit me or because of the yeah, aura? because he hit you. Oh, okay. That's an 11. You need a 13. Okay. So, uh, you have become diseased and poisoned. Yo, if so this is, a, if this is another, like, abyssal wretch thing, I'm quitting. <laughs> <laughs> I'll fucking quit the camping. Uh, so, you now have, like, festering boils uh, coming up Ooh. on your body, and... You're starting to cough a lot, and when you cough, you notice flies are coming out of your mouth. That's a good one. And you notice that (laughs) some of the dust on your skin is actually rotting. Mm. Oh. Let's start scratching it. You shouldn't. Itchy motherfucker. Yeah, probably shouldn't, but I'm diseased. Gross. And your hit point max is reduced by four. So my total becomes 41? Yeah. For how long? Uh, after 24 hours. Oh, fuck. That's fine. Uh, yo, you're so gross. You made me sick. What the hell, dude? Again, he doesn't seem to understand. I uh, translate. Oh. <laughs> Bye, thank you. And I oh, so the disease is... I mean, you can make a saving throw every 24 hours after delapses. Oh, no. Oh. Well, what does it do? Like, it just fucks with my health? Like, is it other things happen? Yes, uh, so it's basically what I just read. So, while poison the three at the target sports, festering boils, coughs of flies, and shreds rotting skin, the target must repeat the save and throw after every 24 hours that elapse. On a successful save, the disease ends. On a failed save, the target's hit points is reduced by four. Uh, the target dies if its hit point is is hit point max is reduced to zero. Oh. Wait, how much does it go down every hour? Four. Uh, four every 24 hours. Oh, every 24. Okay, so Ooh. that's like fine. We, we, yeah, that... we have like a cleric who could maybe do something to help. Yeah, I can definitely cure you maybe if I had some spells. Can rest after um, this. Does it... <laughs> wait, if we're alive. If you... Does it... Give you disadvantage on anything? Does it like nope. affect your current abilities, or I think I just, just I think I just super healthy. gross, yeah. and have like less like HP. You're starting good visions of okay. uh, I do have abysmal wretch blaze, like just seeing how his, what his body is doing now. Cool. Ew. Cool. That's gross. Cool. 
Okay. I wasn't kidding. I'll quit. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> I could do other things. I could play Animal Crossing. I don't know. <laughs> uh, so next is Tal. Um, is this guy... Wait, how far away am I? Uh, you'd probably be... Uh, 80 feet? No, uh, 90 feet away. Alright, well, then I can... I think I can move closer and then throw my uh, darts again. Okay. I'm trying to conserve some spell slots because I assume that we're not done yet. And we're going to need some help. There we go. That's way better. Uh, a 19 and a 24. Yeah, both hit. That's way better than my, uh, <laughs> my 1 and 2 that I rolled last time. <laughs> Uh, one does six damage, and the other does four damage. Six and four. Yeah, big turn for Tal and her daggers. Darts, sorry. That's all I got. So you throw these darts, and one hits him uh, right in the shoulder, and the other hits him in the middle of the stomach. Rad. And you are... You would be 60 feet away now? Yeah, I have a 30 movement speed. Okay. Okay, so next will be Aelrindel. Hell yeah. Um, Why? <laughs> uh, so how far is he away from me right now? Uh, he'd be 90 feet away from you, the same as Cal. Okay, so I'm going to move my 30 feet. Uh, so now he's only 60, and I'm going to again shoot a arrow from my longbow at him. Okay. And this is what I call easy money. Oh, uh, that's yeah, a dirty that's 20, small, baby. Yeah. Wow, it, it worked. What the wow. fuck? No, Name of the show. Me, that's called a win. Yeah, okay. this is this is an epic win. This is for epic all the, Here, this is for all the gamers this, out let there. Let me pick up this crown you just dropped. Right. Oh, and I do nine damage. Okay. Piercing damage. Hey. I pierce him. Nice. Pierce him, real pierce him with your strong will. Okay, uh, any bonus actions or anything? Uh, well, I, I guess I get my second attack, so... I'm gonna shoot again. Okay. Because that's out. how that works. Oh, dude, 19! Yeah, it definitely hits. Bro! And then... I forgot uh, extra attack was a thing. Fuck. Only five piercing damage. Okay. That's it. And then, um, I, uh... I continue on with my day. Okay. Uh, so you you see that this guy now has two darts and three arrows just piercing everywhere on his body. <coughs> Fuck you! <coughs> and we are back up to Lazarus. Okay. So, I moved up 30 feet last turn, so I guess I'll move up uh, another, like, 20 feet or something like that i'll like try and skirt a around him so i don't get within his uh festering yeah. aura yeah you're able to yeah and uh just trying to skirt around till i can see the explosives yeah so if, as you move kind of north a bit more you finally do see the explosives they seem to be about uh 90 feet away so about 40 feet behind the or, wait, no, uh, so 50 feet, no, wait, so, so you're just out of reach of the Valazo, right? Okay, so they seem to be about 60 feet behind the Valazo. Okay, Blaze should be fine from the explosion, but I do, as I'm aiming my arrow, like, I'll, I'll light it up with my tinder box, I'll light up the rags that I have on it, yeah. and then as I'm aiming it, I'll yell out to Blaze, get the fuck out of there! And then I'll see Thanks if I can concern. hit it. Okay. Uh, yeah, so just roll to hit. This will be an That's AC of be... 16. I got a 13. God fucking uh, We pay. You're the ranger. <laughs> so the arrow just barely misses, and 
you see sparks i mean you see flames still on the arrow but it just doesn't seem to move enough to catch the explosives okay uh like how close is the arrow to the explosives uh would i be able to shoot another arrow and hit my first one how about you just shoot your other arrow to hit the explosives instead of trying to be like cool about it? The arrow is probably like three feet away from the explosives. I mean, I need to light it on fire. I can't just shoot a normal arrow and have it blow up. Oh, no, I see your point. Oh, shit! No, fuck, I do! <laughs> not control flame. That's not a real spell, Drew. Alright, uh... <laughs> I have a fire thing. I'm a fucking monk. I have, uh, I have, uh, blah, 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 uh, Fangs of the Fire Snake. So, when you use the attack action on your turn, you can spend a, oh, I don't have any keys. Cool. Should have rested. Yeah. Should have rested. Nice. Right. Should have done that. Yeah. We all that agree. I, that I was right? Yeah. As a fighter, I do not need rest. Yeah. Okay. Well, everybody except for Tony. <laughs> Yeah, well, you're right, Tony. Where would we be without your four damage? Hey, shut up, dude! I did so much damage. Okay, See, I shot there's, two arrows. Hey, this maybe, is nothing else. Maybe as a strength based fighter, you should get up close and personal. And you know what? Maybe next time, instead of shooting my arrow, I'm gonna yes. throw it with by hand. You probably do more damage because then you use your strength modifier instead of your exactly. dex modifier. No, it'd be like throwing a dagger, so it'd still be dex. You can use strength to throw daggers. Yeah. We talked about that last time. Right, yeah, I forgot. Not bad. Yeah, yeah since I can't really it? do Pathetic anything exit. else on my turn, I'm just going to shoot the other arrow and try and knock it in. Okay, uh, so this is a smaller target. Yeah. And it's kind of a heart of a card. It's a very but... difficult thing to do, so I'll put the AC at 20. It is also Go like 90 feet away, head. so. Go get him, Robin Hood! My minimum range is 120 on a longbow. Oh, okay. Let's do this. I rolled a 16 plus 6, that's a 22. Wow. <laughs> nice. You hit this- do You are a fucking god! <laughs> you hit this arrow and it just hits the, uh, the edge of it, and it's able to knock it into the explosives, where after a couple of seconds, you, you notice that the explosives catch, and- a few seconds later, there's this loud boom as the explosives go off, and then these more loud booms as more and more of those explosives go off, and then the ceiling tumbles in on the cavern, filling all of it in. Yes. Dope. Fucking epic, bro. You blew that up. That was awesome. Hey, we baby. are so cool. Oh, we are so here. cool. I know everybody in this dungeon is going to yeah, try to kill I, I mean, Listen, they were kind of doing how that many, before. I don't understand how many yeah, times yeah, I can I make the same warning, but I told you. Don't worry, we got this. But yeah, that's all Ooh. I can do on my turn. Just a quick note for right now. At this point in time, Drew's audio stopped recording for Cal, so we no longer have him, his audio for this episode. Does... Anyone have, does anyone have Liaman's tiny hut? <laughs> Nobody has Liaman's tiny hut. Dude, that thing is a lifesaver. Hut. We're all fucking doomed now. <laughs> Isn't that like Maybe, a seventh level No, spell? that's Mag that's Mordecai's mansion. Liaman's tiny hut's like a fourth level spell. Where's Borknork? <laughs> oh, third level invocation. Yeah. Bro, I play and watch D&D so fucking much. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whatever. No, but maybe maybe Bork Bork. Yeah, that's like a, a bard spell. Yeah, the only spell. problem is like yeah. even if Borknark knew it, that's right. We have so many prisoners who wouldn't fit in. Like, who would we kill? Yeah, yeah. emphasis on Liamun's tiny hut. That's, that's what I said. Yeah, oh. I was agreeing with you. God, fuck. Uh, so, uh, in, uh. In order, so Blaze is still next, and the Balazar is still there. Okay. 
Uh, hey, remember when you hit me and made me all look gross? Well, fuck you, I'm gonna kill you now. And I remembered I have extra attacks, so fuck yeah. Forgot I had that shit. Okay, so I'm gonna hit him with my dagger, and I'm gonna hit him with my dagger, and then I'm gonna hit him with the diamond dagger again. Okay. Actually, I can't do that because I, I threw my obsidian dagger. So I'm gonna hit him with my diamond dagger, and then my diamond dagger, and, and then my diamond dagger. Okay, and before that, can you roll a constitution saving throw since you're within 30 feet of him? Big money! Um, 17. Yeah, you saved. Fine. Sick. Okay, here comes dagger one. Is 14 plus... 21? Yeah, that hits. Second one is... 10. That does not hit. Third one is 17. Yeah, that hits. Okay. They're just stabs and stuff. I'm just stabbing him repeatedly. So the first one is... Roll the 6 plus dex 13. And then the second one is, <laughs> I've rolled a one. So plus dex is five plus three nice. is eight damage. Eight damage. Okay. Booyah. Bitch. So after this, he is starting to look a bit more injured. He just like chopped off an entire section of his horn. And he's bleeding in multiple areas. He's got like three or no like four arrows in him and a couple darts in him so he's not looking good okay i'm gonna like angle my with my movement like i'm not gonna disengage or anything like i don't want to do that so i'm just gonna like maneuver myself to stand between him and everyone else okay uh so next is ryan okay uh and i'm 40 feet away now yep uh cool okay i'll move my 25 feet towards him so i'm 15 feet away and then, uh, I can't really... Wait, Blaze, how, how, where are you, Blaze? From you? Yeah. Uh, well, how far back were you to begin last time? Well, I'm 15 feet away from him now. I can get up to 15. Oh, you're 15, f- yeah. you're 15 wa- feet away from the Bowser? Yeah. Well, then you're 15 feet away from me. You're right in front of him? Well, okay, never mind then. Yeah, I'm like, right, yeah, yeah. I've been stabbing the dude right now. Yeah, so. okay, so I'm just gonna take one of my three remaining daggers and... Chuck it at him. Okay. Plus 16 to hit. Yeah, that hits. Nice. Okay. That's a d4 plus my strength mod is 7 damage. Okay. Cool. Oh, uh, so and you then... throw the stagger and now he, he, his body is just a uh, holding place for weapons now. Nice. Yeah, fuck this clown. Um... And if I throw as an action, can I use a bonus action to throw a second dagger? Is that something anybody can do or is that like a player thing? Yeah, you can. Okay, I'm going to do that then. And that is a... Uh, what was that? Plus seven, 13 to hit. 13. The dagger just nicks his arm that's out and doesn't uh, okay. do you any damage. It is super close, so, yeah. but it did not hit. All right, that's it. Okay. That's my turn. Okay, so next is the Balazo, and it's going to attack Blaze and see her in the way of everyone else. So it's going to use its barbed tail on you again. It got a natural one, so he... He definitely does not hit you. Nice. And then next is Tal. Also, how far how far away are, from him are you? So at this point, Tal approaches the Bulazau and is going to throw a knife and a use a cantrip against the Bulazau. Just note that if you are within thirty feet, then okay. <laughs> oh, uh, I should have done that last turn too, then because I'm fifteen feet away. Yeah. So both. Uh, Daggers and the uh, spell or cantrip you just cast just breeze just barely past him. Just uh, kind of under his arm. And then next is Aelrindal. Uh Gage. Yep. Uh, just real quick. Because I'm within 15 feet of him, I should have done the con save, right? It's at the start of your turn. It's so, not when you just move close to him? No, it's when you start your turn within 30 feet. Oh, okay. So, Elendal. 
Yes. Um. So how far is he away now? Uh, from you, he would be. You ran up thirty feet before, right? Yeah, so I was sixty feet. Yeah, away. Yeah, so you're sixty feet away. Okay. Um, I'm gonna move thirty feet closer. So we'll be thirty feet away, and I'm gonna shoot my arrow again. Okay. That's a ten. That does not hit. No matter. I'm gonna do it again. So that is thirteen. Thirteen. Yeah. Uh, as you shoot the arrow, it just barely nicks his ear, but doesn't actually do damage. Damn it. Now I just made him look cooler. <laughs> yeah. That's a that's a that's worse than a nat one in my eyes. Okay, well I guess fucking that's it. That's it. That's all I got. Okay, and we're back at the top of the order with Lazarus. Okay, so there's only one Bowzow like that's close by, right? Uh, at, roll a perception check. That is a fourteen. Uh, there's only the one there. You also hear commotion coming from behind you, pretty far behind you, though. Okay. Uh, and he's 80 feet away, right? The Balza would be 40 feet away from you. Okay. Because you were just out of range of him when you shot the arrow. I'm going to move 30 feet away towards the commotion and then shoot two more arrows. Okay. At this Balza? Yes. Okay. I got a dirty 20 and an 18. Yeah, both hit. Big rolls. That's uh, 19 damage in total. 19 damage? Yeah, you, you kill him. So one of your arrows hits right where uh, one of the arrows, one of the other arrows was, and just shoves it deeper in while also splitting some of the arrow. Cool. And it kills him. And now that you're facing the other direction, you see that there's one Balazel coming at you guys from that direction. He's probably around 80 feet o- no, uh, 100 feet away from you now. And okay. you think you can see another one further back, and you also see a an Oblex that's just having a meal on some dead body. They just keep coming. Uh, so because some of you are within 30 feet of the body, you will have to do constitution checks again. So th- I think that's Blaze bitch. and yeah. Blaze, Ryan, and Aelendil. That's a how, how far is the range? It's 30 feet. No way. Yeah. It's, but if I'm if right, I'm if I'm if right it's at 30, 30 feet, feet, that means I'm like... Of Bellas, so. But, like, if I'm right at 30 feet, I'm right at the edge. So isn't there potential <laughs> Tony, that Tony just, would not hit me? <laughs> are you resistant to damage, 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 damage anyway? Uh, I don't... I, I think in that, like... I don't think it says I am, yeah. but we can make that a thing. <laughs> I rolled a 14. I rolled a 14. 14? Yeah, Blaze, you're fine. I got a 12. You are not. Oh my god, that's the third time. So, are you sure you want me to roll gauge? Yeah, I do. And okay. Ryan, that's just three necrotic damage. Oh, fucking paltry damage. I'm still good. What if I rolled a seven? Seven, then you fail. Fuck. And you will take two necrotic damage. Oh my god. Yeah, we're fucked. Um, Don't worry, I can heal you guys. Can you? I ha- I can create berries. I create ten of them at a time that heal one HP nice. each. Awesome, that's great. Zach, that's amazing. I'm so happy oh. we have a cleric on our team. Shut the fuck up! <laughs> <laughs> Wouldn't it have been nice if we'd rested? Well, I think we're definitely going down. I don't think so. Uh, okay, uh, I'm gonna use my last spell slot on Blaze 
and cast Lesser Restoration to cure him of his disease. Okay. <gasps> Yo! Thank you! Finally! How can I killed somebody? <laughs> it's not even that. I just, like, it feels good that, that you would cast a nice spell on me. Of course, I always look out for my team. So what is it? Does my hit point go back to normal? Um, let me find... Oh, I have it right here because I was ready. I just end the condition. That's all it says. Oh, then yeah, it goes back yeah. to normal, right? I mean, I don't know if you get Dude, the HP dope. back, but you get your max hit points back to normal at least. Well, no, no, I don't heal. Yeah. Yeah, yeah but I mean, like, my... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I did take damage from it, but, like, then, like, afterward, like, that's not the condition. The condition is that my HP yeah, is Yeah, so that's back to normal. My max HP. And you are no longer okay. coughing flies. Sick. That actually kind of, would have been kind of cool for, like, intimidation that's factors. That's fucking gross. No, I didn't say I liked it. I just said I could use it as an intimidation factor. Gage, what's the name of the monster we're fighting? Uh, that was a Bulazau. B-U-L-E-Z-A-U. Googling it is cheating, guys. Yeah, that's what I, that's what I wanted oh, to know, okay. too. That's all. Yeah. B-U-L-E-Z-A-U. Oh, these things are... What's that? That's in Tome of Foes, yeah. right? Yeah. Yo, I had these completely mixed up with something else. These are fucking terrifying to look at. <laughs> Yeah. It looks like a looks like a goat with like yeah. boils on his face. If I had known they looked like that If I had known they looked like that, I would not have helped Lazarus. <laughs> cool, we won guys. Good for job. Now. Killed that sucker. Alright. Uh, yeah, so, nope. Yeah. Uh it it seems like they're they are. They're definitely running towards where the the explosion happened, and one of them does see Lazarus. You guys should hide and set an ambush. They know we're here; otherwise, they wouldn't run towards us. I'm pre. Do do they see us, Gage? It, one definitely sees Lazarus. I'm gonna okay. I'm gonna do the ambush idea. I'm gonna hide. Okay. Two man team. We got this. Uh, since we're at an hour of time right now, I think that's really where we'll leave it for this episode. And next episode, we'll continue this battle in the depths. Goodbye. <laughs>